Gators win, I win. Looks like everybody's a winner today. Let's get to it. YouTube, what's happening? What's good? Hope everybody's having a great day. It's the one and only Budget Club 1200, and it's my second upload today. <laughs> today was a busy day. Uh, of course. Mailman, got your mail here. Got some mail calls, and then on top of that, I was able to hit another Walmart in my area where I had a figure stashed. So I went out today and picked it up. Um... It was just a busy day today, so let's not waste any time. Let's get into it. Let's get to these reviews. Today, I was able to uh, venture out to actually the same Walmart that I was in yesterday when I uh, did that. Uh, and I had a figure stash, and luckily, it was still sitting there. So, from the latest Marvel Legends wave... The Avengers wave, I give to you Malekith. And I like it. Pretty dope. Uh, I don't really know a lot about Malekith. Um, Y'all have to fill me in in the comment section. Kind of give me a little backstory behind him. But I think this figure is really cool. Uh, of course, I'm on that... That journey to build Cold Obsidian, my first uh, Marvel Legends Build-A-Figure. So, I'm really looking forward to that. Uh, got Cold Obsidian's arm right here. It's Malekith. I mean, it's it's really cool. Um, I am one figure away from building Cold Obsidian. I need, uh, I need Black Knight. Hopefully, I actually have him stashed at my hometown Walmart. So... Hopefully, next week, I'll be able to pick him up and go ahead and build that figure. But, this is a really cool figure. I really like it. Uh, if you see it in your Walmarts, uh, Hot Topics, GameStops, wherever you get your figures, make sure you pick it up. Yeah! Let's get into it. First off, I got I got to give a shout out to uh, my homie Dave. Uh, we were just talking about figures on Twitter, and uh, we were able to complete a trade. Uh, I sent uh, him a couple of Fortnite pops for his son. Uh, shout out to the little guy, and um, he was kindly and gracious enough to uh, send me send me some send me some figs. So uh, let's see what we got. Good lord, this is like one of the best tape jobs ever. Got that open. And we got. Oh, and he sent me a note. My first note on the channel. He said, uh, thanks for the six. Because I traded him uh, my. Uh, my uh, Elite Series uh, NWO 6. I was willing to part ways with that. Yeah. So, got my first note. Really cool, man. Appreciate it, David. You're a true winner. And from the Elite Collection Series... I don't know what series this is from. Actually, I do know what series this is from. From the WWE Elite Collection, we got Kevin Owens. And this is my second Kevin Owens figure. Uh, comes with the NXT Championship. And uh, that belt's going to get used. So y'all stick around for that. 
and uh this is really cool i really like this figure um wow like i said this is my second kevin owens figure this is really dope um i'd actually had been looking for this figure for a while never found it and you know dave was cool enough to part you know to part ways with it so shout out to the homie dave really appreciate it um yeah and like i said the belt's getting used so make sure y'all stay tuned box number two let's go And he sent another note. He said, uh, thank you for the, uh, thank you for the, uh, Fortnite pops. If my camera will focus. Anytime, brother. Anytime you're willing to, uh, want to trade with me, just let me know, man. Two notes on the channel. I feel like I'm making progress. And we got from the Elite Series. We got this Triple H. And this is a dope figure. We all know about Triple H. No need to wrestling fans know about Triple H, what he's done, what he's doing now. No need to list off his credentials. Um the attire is from WrestleMania 30. Bruh. Where he had that match with Sting, which, in my personal opinion, he shouldn't have went over, but that's neither here or there. But this is a really cool figure. Um, dope. Ain't much more you can say to it. I actually have seen this figure in a couple of Walgreens, but just never thought to pick it up. But, you know, Dave, he was cool enough to trade with me, and uh, yeah. Shout out to Dave again, brother. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you. And last but not least, also from that Elite Collection, this is from the flashback. Best there is, best there was, and the best there ever will be. We got Bret Hart with the old school tag titles. Well, the tag title belt. Man, I've actually seen this figure in stores and just never thought to pick it up. And I've also seen the uh, Jim, Jim the Anvil Nightheart, may he rest in peace, figure that, that comes along with this that has the other tag belt. If I can ever find that figure, I'd love to have it just to complete the Heart Foundation set. Because the, the Heart Foundation is one of my top 10 tag teams of all time. And anybody who grew up on 80s wrestling, 90s wrestling, they know about this guy. We don't even need to list off his credentials, not to mention talk about the Montreal Screwjob, which is 21 years old as of yesterday. So, yeah, really cool figure. Not much to say about this. It's a dope figure. Pick it up if you see it. So, you remember when I said the that NXT title on that Kevin Owens is about to get used? Well, stay tuned for just one second. Excuse me for a second. Eight hours later. Which felt like eight hours digging through all of that back there. Um, Demon Finn Balor. Kevin Owens with NXT title. Let's see how this turns out. Eventually. Bam. It was a struggle getting this belt on this guy, but damn it, I got it on. 
And as a result of that, my hand's cramping, but it's all good though. But yeah, this is my personal touch on the uh, FYA exclusive Demon Finn Balor. Really, really like this. I think this this was the 50th pop I bought. And uh, I figure, why not give him a title? So, there you go. Here is just a small recap of everything. We got this Malekith. We got Kevin Owens. We got Trips. We got Break the Hitman Heart. And we just customized this FYE exclusive Demon Finn Balor. And I got my first two notes from from people I trade with. So yeah, not too shabby. And those are my reviews. Last week has been good. Last couple of weeks have been good. Uh, we just went over the 250, 250 milestones. So we're gaining traction on that grind to 500. And uh, it's definitely going to be a journey. But I have faith in myself and my brothers in the budget club who helped me out on the channel that we'll get there. So it's all about putting in the work. And that's pretty much it. If you're new to the channel, you like what you see, you know what to do. Super kick that subscribe button. Be sure to like, comment, and share. Hit that bell notification for upcoming content. Remember to be blessed. Be good to your fellow man. And I will see you on the next one. Super kick!